Hi everybody and welcome back to Build Notebook Campers. Hopefully you've seen my last video, which has brought you to this one. Um, if you haven't checked out my last video um, and why I disappeared from YouTube, check out the link on the card up there. So yes, this video is about all the events that I will be attending next year. So, and, um, in different respects, different aspects at each event. So, first of all, we're going to Van Life Chill Outs. The two I did last year were fantastic. I will be doing Van Life Chill Outs again in 2023. Um, we just need to organise with John and Donna to get them sorted. We're going to get them sorted and we're going to be there because they were fantastic. Uh, the International Camp Van Show, two of them again this year. Um, Literally, we will be at them as we always are. We seem to be part of the furniture now. Not only that, um, I have been asked to DJ at both those events this year, so we're gonna put on some really exciting um, music that night, those two nights, um, because Van Life Eats went down a screen last year, this year will be the same. So, also you have Camper Jumble, which is also at Stratford, where the ICS International Caravan Show is held. Now, that's only a day event, but there's camping from the Friday night early, so and they're gonna put a disco on in the bar for that, so I'll DJ on that one. Also, Van Life Festival. Um, Van Life Festival has moved from Stratford, and it's what I can, I've been talking to the organizers, and by the sounds of it, it's gonna be a massive event as well. Another big event. Now, I've spoken to them about DJing there, I'm not quite too sure, that's a maybe, maybe not, so I'm not gonna say I am. But, as usual, same as the International Camp Man Show, I will be at Van Life Festival, doing what I always do. You'll see me running around on the truck. Might have one or two new little vehicles with me to run around with as well, but again, you'll see when you get there. If you haven't booked your tickets yet, book your tickets for the International Camp Man Show, book your tickets for Van Life Festival, get them now, trust me, they're gonna be good events. And what can I say, Van Life Eats. Um, so Van Life Eats, last year was an absolute scream for me. I loved it. I DJed with Neil from Urban Van Life. And again, we're DJing next year. Um, we, we've sort of had a little discussion and we've said that it's gonna be majorly epic, whatever we do. We haven't decided what yet. So again, get your tickets for Van Life Eats now. Don't miss it. Um, it was really good last year. Um, not forgetting the food, we had our f food business there, so everybody loves our food, especially Gorilla Grub. So that will be there, as it was last year. Um, again, we we're also in touch with Catman Show and Van Life Festival, and Van Life Chill Outs with the food. Um, right, there's one we, I did last year called Van Life Chill. Now, yes, this is on the same date as Camp Quirky. Now, um, there's no reason for that, it's just on that. Now, I'm part of another group that organises Van Life Chill, and I had to show my loyalty to do Van Life Chill, as I always will do and would do. So, Van Life Chill is gonna be held at the Turnpike Showground in Shaftesbury. So, get your tickets for that one. Um, to do that, you need to go to Facebook, go to the South Central self build get together or just type in Van Life Chill on Facebook. And it's run by Darren who runs the South Central self build get togethers. Now I'm part of the admin on that group so hence where my loyalty lies for that show or that event. Van Life Chill is a basic, we all get into a field, fire pits, drinks, food, have fun. And it is a very chilled weekend, but it's good. So also South Central Self Build Get Togethers. I don't really plug this one enough, so I'm going to tell you a little bit more about that. So this event was set up for people who have bought vans that need maybe a little bit of help, a little bit of advice on building their van, relax, anything, fitting heaters, uh, doing electrics, anything. You've got quite a few experts in this one field now. Where, and again, it's at the Turnpike Showground in Shaftesbury. So there's enough people there that can advise you. 
Now, the aim of the group, when I say advice and help, it's help you to do your van. The idea is not for you to take your van there and let everybody do the job for you. No, that's not it. It's there so you can help, we can help you do your vans yourself. Uh, many things happen there. Your young, young girl turned up to one of the events, never cut a hole, even though I've used a jigsaw before, but she cut a hole in a van with help and put a roof in him. So there's, you know, so many people with little to no experience going away with skills. That's the aim of this group. Um, so please don't mistake it like you bring your van, turn up, somebody do the job for you. It's not that at all. Um, you've got many skills there, many people that can help, many people that are able to help and willing to help. That's a sink bubbling away there. Right. So get yourself that one. Now finally, it leads me to one of the big events that I'm doing called Van Life and Overlander Celebration. Um, I will be putting out a separate video on that to launch the tickets for that one. Now, this event, I was asked to do this event because of all the other events I do. Now, and I was asked because somebody said to me, can you bring all the good bits from all those events, bring it into this event and make a new event? And I said I could do that. So, hence I was challenged with that task and hopefully, between the team, they can pull it off. So, it, again, it's called a Van Life and Overlander Celebration. Now, why is it called that? Now, many reasons. It was just gonna be called Van Life Celebration, but for, for me, I managed to get them to change it because it didn't cover enough. Van Life is just vans. Now, I've noticed amongst shows, communities and everything, the van life scene is very much separate from the overlander scene. The overlander scene and van life scene is very separate from the VW scene. So if you look at the logo, the logo's got a VW, it's got a van in it, it's got an overlander in it, and it's even got a motorhome in it. Um, so the logo was even very carefully structured and put together. And um, every event is a show, an event, a festival. The team wanted to provide somewhere where it can celebrate everything in one place. And this is exactly what they're gonna do. So, it's, there will be music there. No, do you know what, I'm, that's it. I'm not gonna go on to it. I'm gonna do a separate video on this one. So, keep an eye out for the next video on this. Um, so, Van, Over, Van Life and Overland Celebration. It's in Newbury in, on July the 28th. Um, I think it's the first weekend as the children break up for holidays. Right, also, that's the events that we're actually doing, the events that we're hoping to attend at the moment. I say, this list will grow. Bear in mind, um, this is December, and we want to make sure that in January, um, we have a bigger list going out. So events we're going to attend is you've got Camper Mart in Telford, um, which is usually in February. We always there filming, and um, last one I was out, I met up with Damo and Terry from Van Life Festival. Um, there's also one in June, which is the Warner uh, Camp Out, which is held in Crawley. We're going to be at that one. Um, and again, just as customers, just to relax at a show, because we haven't had that much of a chance. And then you've also got in the year, the NEC Motos, Car Motorhome Caravan Camping Shows. We want to be at one or two of them as well. We do like those. Um, and again, we want to be there filming. We want to see what new developments, new innovations, things come out because to give us ideas when it comes to building our own vans. But this list, or these lists, will grow. Um, if you've got any questions or queries regarding any of the shows, any of the events, um, I am dealing with a little bit of trade on the Van Life and Overland Celebration. My email is below. You can contact me and I will pass on your details and request to uh, whoever's going to be dealing with it. Um, they're very proactive and do get back to you very, very soon. If not, I will be coming back to you myself with an answer or with um, 
and date it when it's going to be dealt with. Right, so that's the events for 2023, or should I say the start of the events for 2023. Every year seems to get more exciting. Um, and one other thing is, most of you know the, I should say the Cowsberg van. Um, I will, all right, it's on one of my other videos. It's the Transport T4 that tows the cut and shut VW Polo, which is painted like a cow. And everything's related around a cow and their van. Um, you've got Sam and um, John, funniest guys on this earth. Well, I have tasked them to build me something. And um, I've seen a couple of photos and bits for it. And oh my God. So we've got something coming, which is gonna be at the show. So if you're interested, please come to the shows, come and have a look, um, you know, we want to be as part of the shows as anybody. We really do. So we, we are growing our fleet and everything, growing this, growing that, getting this, getting that. And this year, instead of me being in that green transit, I am going to be in my black new bus. So keep an eye out for that as well. Anyway, that's all I've got time for today. And you know what? It's so good to be back talking to you guys. It feels good. And hopefully I'll see some of you somewhere in a field next year or on the road, who knows? Anyway, I hope you have a great new year, all of you, and I hope you have enjoyed your Christmas. Staying healthy, staying well. Anyway, I'll see you soon. Bye for now.